One day, one day, one day, one day, one day, you might see me in a whole new way. One day, one day, one day, one day, one day, but still a seated on the same OJ. One day, one day, one day, one day, one day, one day, you might Michael Jordan, remember I interviewed him years ago. And I said, What makes you the best in the world? Is it skill? Is it talent? Is it ability? Is it background? Is it training? And he was so awesome. He said, Tony, I can tell you the truth that it won't sound like hyperbole or false modesty. He said, I didn't even make the high school basketball team my sophomore year. I was cut. He said, what it is, is every day I demand more from myself than anybody else could possibly expect. I don't compete with other people. I compete with what I'm capable of. Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Welcome to CN Tech, man. My name is Jay Sin. Coming back with another one, man. Y'all already know the most hot and woke us up this morning. Let's take this opportunity to be great, you know what I'm saying? But let me show y'all what it looked like real quick. Look at that. You know what I mean? The light shining on you, man. Let's, let, look at the most high, man. Look what we get to wake up to. Look at this opportunity that you have, bro. The sun in your face, man. If you don't get your ass up and get out there and be better than who you was yesterday. Come on, man. Let's do it. Let's do it. But I want to tell y'all real fast, man. Listen, man. You got to understand that the people around you never seen this type of change, right? so quickly you know what i mean the people around you not used to this type of change at, at, at this magnitude in you not everybody doing what you doing like i always tell you they not used to seeing unk like this you know they not used to seeing their cousins like this bro at this magnitude it's unheard of this journey that you on unheard of you know they saw you one way at one point and now you this way now so it's striking to them, it's mind blowing to them, you know? So you gotta understand that, bro. Not everybody is used to this shit. They don't see this type of change at this magnitude. You know, what you doing is so different right now, you know? So you are gonna have a lot of mixed feelings about it, but you can't let that stop you, you know? It's that big. What you doing right now is that big in your life. You know, so the people around you, they not used to it. Everybody ain't no, every, everybody ain't on this shit. Everybody not trying to get to the next level like you. They zeroed in on one thing. They think that just one thing going to get it for them. But you working on everything right now. So you got to think like you got some people, you got maybe some people that's around that may be just thinking about the money. You got some people around that may be just thinking about school. You got some people around that's just in a in a relationship and they just trying to build that. You know, and I'm not saying that there's anything wrong with the people around. You know what I'm saying? But you got people that's just zoning in on certain things. You, you know, you you thinking about everything, but you putting yourself right in the middle of it. You know, because a lot of times when you think about all those people that's zoning in on these different areas, right? You know, they solely focused on that and they leaving themselves out. You would think that they thinking about themselves, but they not looking at themselves first. You know, they just thinking school going to fix it. They just thinking money going to fix it. They just thinking marriage going to fix it. You know what I'm saying? They just going to think this person going to fix it. That person going to fix it. They just thinking that God going to fix it. You know what I'm saying? And it don't work like that. You know what I mean? You got to still look to yourself no matter what. So this change that they seeing in you and it's so it's happening so rapidly, they don't understand it. And it's only up from here. That's what you got to understand. When you stay here, it's only up from here. You know, so you're going to have people around that's curious. You're going to have people around that's hating. You're going to have people around that don't want to mess with you no more. They, they, they don't know. They don't, they don't know you like that no more. So they don't know how to take you, bro. I done brought it up before, but I got to bring it up again because some of y'all still, y'all, y'all forget this. Y'all be like, man, what, what, I, what I do? What I do? You didn't do nothing, bro. You didn't do nothing but put you first. You didn't do nothing but work on you. You didn't do nothing but try to level up and ditch all of that old shit that you used to do. You didn't do nothing but get rid of those addictions that you had. You know what I mean? You didn't do nothing, bro. That's all you did. Oh, you, you didn't do nothing but start to see the value in yourself, bro. That's what you did. You didn't do nothing, though. All you did was see yourself like, oh, okay, you know what I'm saying? And you starting to capitalize off your investment. So now Muggs is puzzled, like literally, like they puzzled, like these pieces, they don't know where to put what. What did this nigga do? What did he do? 
You know what I'm saying? And, and then it's like, yo, man, so you're going to have some people, man. You're going you're gonna to get mixed emotions, mixed feelings. You know, you're going to have people that don't like you. You know what I'm saying? That's just That just comes with it. You got to understand, that just comes with it, bro. This journey is like no other. This is something else. People not on this. People not on it, and people don't want to be on it, bro. Most of them. Most people, they not. So you the first one in your circle that's doing this. You the first one in your family that's doing this, bro. You know, so you got to understand that, man. People ain't go, they, 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 they puzzled. They don't know what to think about you. But you can't let that stop you, man. You can't let that get you. You, you can't have a big head because of that. You got to stay humble in this process and move forward. You know that it's for a bigger cause. That At this magnitude, bro, this is life changing. This is life altering. You know, and it's for the greater purpose of you, the greatest purpose of the greater purpose of your family. You know what I mean? So you got to do this, bro. You have to be you have to be that one. You have to be that one that change everything that change everything. So you're going to be the one, man. You that main pillar that's going to change the whole dynamic of your family. You that main pillar that's going to change the whole dynamic of your situation. And a lot of times people get some people, man, the people that's important, they they can't do nothing but respect you for it because you chose to put yourself through this type of difficulty, this type of fucking discipline, this level of focus. You know, and all you did was look at yourself. So don't think it's something that you did. You did what it took to level up in your life. You did what it took to get to that next round that everybody else seemed to give up on. You understand, man, most people give up in their life, you know, and that's not nothing to just sit there and, 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 and hammer people for, man, because we was close to giving up. I was close to giving up. So I'm not going to sit there and think that I'm better than the next when I was just on that edge of going back to who I was because I felt like I didn't have nothing left. I can't do that. I can't do that. I can't look down on the next person because I was close to where they was at. I lived that life that they lived, bro. You know what I'm saying? I lived that and that shit was tough. That shit was hard. And then when you start putting in the work, and you still see yourself not going nowhere, bro, listen, that will break you. That will make you go right back to where you was because that was the only place where you was happy at, where you was happy but miserable at the same time. The only time you was happy was when you was under the influence. The only time you was happy was when you was fapping and watching porn. The only time is you that, that you was happy is when you was around other people and it shouldn't be like that. You should be happy to look at yourself in the mirror and see the best version of you. You should be happy that you are alive and got another opportunity, bro. You should be happy to just be living life. But when you need all these substances, all of this bad shit just to survive, just to get through the day, you know what I mean? It shouldn't be like that. You know what I mean? You shouldn't need to be eating bad food just to make you feel alive and happy. That's the only spot where you comfortable at because you eating bad food. Because that food is your only friend. You got people out there that food is their only friend. You know what I'm saying? And meanwhile, they just drowning deeper and deeper into bad health. Deeper and deeper into weight. They weight is like a shell. You know what I'm saying? They in the inside, but everything around, all that weight, they carrying that shit around. All those emotions, they carrying that shit around. All those addictions, they carrying that shit around, bro. All of that hate, people that be having all that hate, all that hate, they carrying that shit around. That shit is a burden on them. It's eating them inside out. It's eating people inside out. So we had to be here. We needed to be here. And we blessed to be here, my nigga. We blessed. So you got to understand this level of blessing, bro. You can't take this shit for granted. You can't take it for granted. You can't be playing around all the time thinking this shit is a game. Ain't nothing a game when you on semen retention, nigga. Because you knew that you was on that edge just like mostly everybody that's in this world. You knew that you was on that edge. You knew you was about, you knew you was about to give up. You knew you was about to throw in that white towel. So you ain't no better than the next, but you still have to respect this grind and stay on it. You know what I mean? You still got to understand that this, this change is at a magnitude that ain't nobody ever seen. 
You know what I'm saying? At a magnitude that nobody ever seen. So guess what? You gonna be that one that change everything. But you gotta go through it. You can't get too cocky in this. You know what I mean? You can't get lax into this. You know what I'm saying? You can't. You can't. So you gotta continue to move forward, man. Listen, bro. This type of change, this shit, hey, hey, this blessing don't come to everybody. You know, people may hear about it. People may know about it. The, the, the light starting to get out there. People starting to hear about the shit. It's starting to get gain more and more traction. But that, that don't mean nothing. That don't mean nothing. We hear about all types of things that, 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 that people are successful with. But that don't mean that everybody is willing to do it. That don't mean nothing. They just heard about it. They see it working for somebody, but it may be too it may be too much for the next person to handle. Like shit, I can't bust a nut. I can't watch porn. You know what I mean? I gotta stay away from women for a certain amount of time until I get my shit together. Fuck that. You know, this all I got. All I got is the porn. All I got is the drugs. All I got is the alcohol. All I got is the pussy. That I, I, I can't get that up. You know, without that, I'm nothing. And it's sad though. You know what I'm saying? It's sad, though, because you got people that really feel without those things, they are nothing. They are nothing. They are nothing. You know? So we have to get out of that. Understand that this is a blessing that most people can't do. You can hear about it. You can see about it. Bruh, but not everybody can do this shit. So with that being said, keep going. First, I'ma get on my grind. Then second, stop wasting my time. Uh, on shit less important. If ain't about money, I'm going the other direction. And third, I'ma do what I gotta to eat. Fourth, I'ma sew up the streets. Fifth, I'ma never quit dropping this heat. So as long as I'm breathing, you better get used to me. Sixth, I'ma get on.